Hey everyone, it's James from Fun Foods, and today I'm going to show you how to make these Oreo truffles that look like either Christmas ornaments or snowmen. So keep watching, and I'll show you step by step how to make these. Now the first thing you want to do is start with a package of Oreo cookies. What I have here is a family pack, so I'm not going to use all of this. It's a little larger than the regular package. But if you just use a regular package, use the whole package, it works fine. It's going to be about 30 Oreo cookies total. So just put them in your food processor. Now if you don't have a food processor, what you can do is put it in a large bag, a large plastic bag, and use something heavy and just smash them down. So this isn't necessary, but it makes my life a little easier. So I'm just going to put the lid on here, turn it on, and I'm just going to pulse it until I get them into real fine bits. It looks pretty good. Next what I have is one 8 ounce package of cream cheese. This has been softened at room temperature so it's nice and soft. I've just cut it in half so it'll be easier to fit in my food processor. And you can do this separately but I'm making it easy and only going to have one thing to clean up. So food processor and just pop the lid back on here and pulse again. Next what we're going to do is scoop little balls out. Actually we're going to roll them into balls, but um, so I'm going to take about an inch worth, just pop it out in my hand here, and then roll it into a ball shape. Place it on a baking sheet with baking paper. This is actually wax paper. You can use any kind of uh, paper you like. Uh, as long as it doesn't stick to it. Now this recipe made about 20 of these. Now it's going to depend on the size that you roll them to, but it made about 20. So now I'm just going to take these, put these in the freezer for about a half hour to get them nice and hard. So now our Oreo balls have been in the freezer for about a half hour. They're nice and chilled and they're nice and solid. So this is what we're looking for. Now I've melted down some white candy melts or you can use white chocolate, whichever you prefer. And now that that's melted down, I'm just going to take these and dip it in the white chocolate. Tap it down really good and then you can just take it and put it on some wax paper for it to harden up. Now I just put these in the refrigerator to speed up the process a bit, but you can just leave them on the counter and they'll harden up quite nicely. Um, you can just pull them apart, and I like to clean up around the bottom a little bit, just with a butter knife is fine, just so it's nice and round. Now I'm going to decorate these a little bit by putting on a cap. Now how do I do that? I have these Reese's Minis, and I'm just going to grab some of them and put them on here. Take them, put them upside down. I've melted down some chocolate, and I'm just going to put it right dab on the middle there. Ooh, that's a lot. <laughs> and then pop my little Reese's Mini right on top there. When that's done, you can decorate the face of the snowman. Now you can do this a couple different ways. Uh, you can cut a small hole out of your baggie. Um, I'm not doing that. I have a pretty large hole right there. So I just squirted some out on the counter and I'm just taking a toothpick, the back of a toothpick, and I want to draw all the eyeballs. So I'm going to put one eyeball there, and one eyeball there. And I'll come back and do the nose in a minute because that's going to be a different color. And we're going to put a dot for a smiley face, another dot, probably like four or five dots for a smiley face. And we'll come back later and do the nose. So now what I've done was I've melted down some orange candy melts and I'm going to draw the nose on each of these. Just a little dot or line and do a little line there right on his face and that's it that's what they look like now we're going to move on to the ornaments okay so we pulled out our remaining oreo balls here and we're just going to dip them in different color candy melts so i have red green and yellow you can use whatever colors you'd like and uh, let's pick one here pop that in Take off the excess. Place it on the other paper. Now 
Now you can take these, you can put them in the refrigerator just so they can harden up a little bit, about 10 minutes. And after they come out of the refrigerator, just take it and clean up around the edges. Now to decorate these, you can use these Reese's Minis to look like the top of an ornament, sort of like that. And I've just melted down some chocolate. Now you can use the same color chocolate as you have on there. I'm just going to use chocolate just to make it easier so I don't have to melt a whole bunch of different colors still. And place it right on top. Push it down and let it set up. Next what I have here are these pull and peel Twizzlers. And what I've done was fold them up. And I've left them this way for a little while so that hopefully they will stay put. Do quite a bit of them. <laughs> so I'm going to put a little, a good amount on the bottom of that. And hold it in place. You may have to hold it there for until it firms up completely. And just do that with the rest of them. Okay, so now it's time for the taste test, and I am going to eat this red ornament. Now, this one isn't completely decorated, it doesn't have the, uh, the stem on there, but it'll still taste just as good, trust me. Mmm, chocolate with the Oreos, and they're easy to make. Well, thanks everyone for watching. I hope you enjoyed watching me make these Oreo truffles that look like either Christmas ornaments or snowmen. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. Also hit that big red subscribe button if you're not already subscribed because you get new videos every week. And for the whole month of December, I'll be doing two videos a week, one on Sunday, one on Thursday. So be sure to check back often. Also check out some of the videos I have off to the side. I think you may enjoy those as well. And as always, see you next week.